set up an us versus them dynamic. That is why in every prophetic church, which is a cult, there's always an us versus them dynamic. That is why you always pray against your enemies, us versus them. You always pray against your enemies. Anyone who does not agree with you is an enemy. Anyone who does not agree with your pastor is your enemy, us versus them. Anyone who does not agree with your church is an enemy. Anyone who does not agree with your belief is an enemy. It is all part of the occultic system that is built so that the people who follow these cults can be easily manipulated, easily deceived into following these things. That is why you hear, by fire, by thunder, your enemies will fall this year. Which enemies? Which ones? Which enemies will fall ever since you started praying against your enemies? How many enemies have fallen? Do you think God, in his graciousness and in his mercifulness, he will allow someone whom he personally created, after his own image and after his likeness, he will allow your fire prayer that you are doing with your false prophet in your occultic church? Because you are saying fire, 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 and God will allow that fire to go and burn your enemies simply because you don't like them? Because they disagree with your church and because they disagree with your pastor? Something must be wrong in here. There has to be a re-evaluation and a revisitation of your mind. You've been brainwashed. Your prayers can never kill anybody. All these false prophets lying to you that I'll pray against you and my prayers will kill. Do you think God in his mercifulness, he will allow prayers of a false prophet to kill somebody simply because the false prophet does not agree with them? Ah, <laughs> Guys, come on. Let's, let, let's face reality, you know. Let's face reality and, and, and face facts as they come. All these prayers that you pray in your church, these are occultic prayers. These are occultic prayers. According to the law, number 27, in the 48 laws of power, that's an occultic prayer that you are praying. My enemies will die. My enemies will fall by fire, by thunder. My enemies in my village. My enemies in my, in my home. My enemies in my hometown. My enemies wherever I come from. My enemies at, at, at my workplace. Uh-uh. No, no, no. They will not fall. They will not die. They were created by God. After the image and the likeness of God, there is no way your fake fire prayers can make them fall. It's impossible. God loves everybody. The same way he loves you is the same way that he loves them. 